What's good, YouTube? DM Gaming here, guys. Man, it's been a month, guys, and I feel refreshed. I'm kind of used to my schedule now, so I want to start back up the video uploads. I'm excited about this. Got a lot of different content from a lot of different areas to bring you over several different games. But before I do, I want a quick word shout out from our sponsor. Let's take a listen. Welcome to Trust Dice, your gateway to top-notch crypto casino action and unbeatable sports betting. Trust Dice is one of the largest crypto casinos and sports books with a global user base of over 100 countries. Check out the incredible odds we have for upcoming esports events. Don't forget, we also offer popular in-house games like Dice and Crash for a variety of gaming thrills. Trust Dice isn't just about gaming, it's about creating unforgettable betting experiences. With stellar reviews and unbeatable odds, it's time to place your bet where it counts. Check the description for direct links to the esports betting section. All links will be provided in the description box for Trust Dice. Go check them out if you are 18 or older. So, guys, over the month, okay, I've been playing college football, okay? Understand my schedule has been crazy, so I've had to limit my playing, okay? But I wanted to go back and kind of talk about something because one thing I noticed playing this game is, you know, I've worked my way up, as y'all know, the Heisman difficulty. And with the very shoot, I am lighting up the skies. Like, it is no joke at how crazy uh, it is to throw the football in this game. One thing I noticed, and that's what I kind of want to talk about today, is like, bro, I'm not rushing for like two, three, four hundred yards. Like, I don't know if it's because I'm playing on Heisman. Now, I can run the ball. Don't get me wrong. If I really try, I don't I don't know if I've had a 200-yard rushing game yet. And I've had some pretty decent backs in the backfield. And I want to kind of know, like, do, is it everybody that's having these, these types of run games? So, like, is it just me? I would like to know in the comment section down below, are you guys able to run the football? Like, is that something that you're able to do? And it, I would say this. Let me know, first of all, what difficulty setting that you're playing on. And then what are you averaging per game? You don't have to go into the game and look at it and say, you know, add it up and stuff. You can kind of gauge. Like for me, I'm probably averaging anywhere from 100 to 120, 130 rushing yards a game if I try because a bunch of games I'm not gonna lie to y'all man I'm just able to air it out very shoot sling that ball around get yards and put the backups in you know either you know depending on who I'm playing maybe even in the first half you know or you know into the end of the beginning of the second half so and, and I wonder I mean you turn on college football you look on TV and you you really don't see people rushing for two three hundred yards while you know, that is realistic. You do see teams airing it out, and it's easy to rack up passing yards. You really don't see that, and the game does reflect that. But I remember in games past, especially when you got a running back that's like 98 speed, 99 speed, and I've played with teams through dynasty modes where I've had a running back that was 96 speed, you know. I had a back that was 98, 99 speed. And it, it's weird. Like, he didn't just walk off from everybody. He didn't just – it, it wasn't like I could just sit there and rush for so many yards. And I never tried to lower the difficulty to kind of see if that was the issue, more or less. But it, it is one of those deals where it's like, I wonder. You know, maybe I'll experiment with that this weekend. I'll be able to get on the game uh, Saturday because, you know, tomorrow, Friday night, lights, baby. Y'all watching this video may be on Friday. Ball games tonight. Have some free time Saturday. A little bit of free time Sunday. And I'll be able to see, is this something, you know, that, is it just because of the difficulty setting that I'm on? And if so, then that's fine. I actually like it. It's it, To me, it resembles more of real life. Because you don't, at, at the top tier level of college football, you don't see a bunch of backs rushing for 250 plus yards a game. Like, yeah, 250 yard rushing day is a outstanding day on the ground. And then in today's world where you have 
so many different types of offenses and most of them are spread based you know i get it if you're playing with an option style team like navy or army or air force or kennesaw state teams that like to run the option a lot flex bone all that kind of stuff yeah you're gonna have a lot of passing yards so i guess i'm talking more to the teams that run spread that may run like myself the veer and shoot you know because the veer and shoot is set up. i mean you're spreading out the defense you are taking the corners and the safeties are not in the game. Like they are so spread out uh, that running the ball should be fairly easy. But I found it to be rather difficult. I don't. But at the same time, I don't know. Maybe it's one of those I just hadn't focused on having a game-breaking running on the ground type of deal. If that makes sense. So I'm wondering that, guys. And I want to know y'all thoughts in the comment section down below. Like I said, guys, I apologize for not uploading within the past month. I had to get used to my schedule. And yeah, I guess that took a month. I'm finally kind of used to it. And so my upload schedule uh, is going to be definitely like Wednesdays, uh, Saturdays and Sundays because Monday and Tuesdays are very late days for me. Thursdays is game day, 7th, 8th grade in JV, and then Friday is game days for varsity. So the, the the three days that I can guarantee you, like I may upload in the morning on Monday and Tuesday and Wednesday or whatever, but I can 100% guarantee you I'm going to be uploading every Wednesday, Saturday, and Sunday. Aside from that, it'll be sparsely uploading. Also, I do want y'all to understand I've been covering college, covering college football but guys, I've also been playing Black Myth Wukong, and it is legit. If you haven't tried it, go and try it. Sparking Zero comes out in less than a month. Assassin's Creed comes out, I want to say, in November. Guys, I'm going to be getting on other games. I want to spread this channel to be more focused on gaming in general, okay? So be prepared for that. Uh, tomorrow's video, I'll be able to do one. Actually, Fridays. I'll be able to upload Friday mornings. I am going to do a video tomorrow talking about my experience with Black Myth Wukong. So if you're interested in that and college football and Sparking Zero and Kakarot and gaming, period, man, click the subscribe button. Subscribe to the channel right now. Don't be a point dexter. Get out the portal and become five star, guys. I hope y'all have an amazing night, evening, morning, whenever it is that you're watching this video. Till next time, y'all. Thanks for watching. Peace.